Well, you know what time it is. It's lunchtime. Sonia's <laughs> best time of the day, and we are in the kitchen again. I really, where else would we be? <laughs> Brugger's may be your favorite place to go for bagels, mm. but they offer a lot more. Here to show us some of your other Brugger's options. David Katz is back. Yes. Welcome, Dave. Thanks hey, for girls, being here. I know Dave wants to come in for a hug, like Joe. Go on, give <laughs> some love. Go ahead. You can give us some love. She it's all right. Every, I'm, I'm not going to hug you. Don't I don't want to make you uncomfortable. No. Not that I don't it's like you, Dave. <laughs> Listen, talk with us because you're making something interesting today. Last time you were here, you made some really cool sandwiches. This one is a little bit different. Yeah, uh, this is the sesame chicken salad. Okay. And that's the Roma roast beef. That's um, we brought out fresh break bread. Okay. And um, yeah, it's not on a bagel. People enjoy that. And this is the roast beef here. Now, how do you get all this started? Can you walk us through how we start on I'll this? I'll switch spots with you so okay. you can do that. Okay. Okay. Because um, I think a lot of people don't realize that they can go to Brugger's and get get a sandwich like that, right? Well, we change around the whole menu. Now okay. it's uh, you know really large lunch menu. Mm -hmm. Eight new sandwiches, paninis now. Oh. Uh, there we go. See yeah, here. Yeah. See, he's tempting us with the paninis, but this is going to make me happy too. So come on in here. Okay. So All the right. roast beef. Okay. We're going to put a little sun dried tomato paste on it. All oh, right. That sounds good. Doesn't it? You're going to have that roast beef. I think he brought some special for me. I brought some vegetarian sandwiches for yeah, you. Yeah. He, he learned his lesson beef. last time. Didn't he? Yes, I did. <laughs> that was a pickup last time. You remember that one? That, <laughs> you did I'm, not pick him up, did you? She, she can't I'm pick strong me up. like a bull. You know that. She, she can't pick me up. Oh, easy. He's kind of confident when he says that. Okay. All right. So, so now what are we doing? You got roast beef, mm -hmm. you got provolone. Okay. A man who cooks. Oh. Yes, well, this is sort of a man who assembles right now, but, okay. yeah. but I'm sure I, he can cook. I went to culinary school. <laughs> oh, there you go. I went to culinary All school. right. Okay. So then what is what is the key though? I mean, I'm sure the taste is in really the sauce in the bread. Yeah. It is. Yeah. As is the calories and uh, the carbs, but Well, it's gonna... it's not that bad. And you've got a little balsamic on there. Oh, so oh, it is actually pretty bad. healthy then. Yeah. Okay. And then cheese. And some other cheese, obviously you can do away with that. I have a feeling you're going to make me take a big old bite out of that sandwich. And she is not it? afraid. Well, Desiree's not going to. No, not but me. I will do it. In the meantime, tell mm -hmm. us about cuz you said you, you have go. a number of varieties of sandwiches, right? This is uh, our catering platter. We do a lot of catering. Um, corporations call every day of the week, at least for five or six of these. Um, it's got a variety of four different sandwiches. We cut it up in halves for you. We can do quarters also. Mm -hmm. And um, we deliver it to you, too. What are some of the other sandwiches that you have, though? We've got Leonardo the Veggie, which is a vegetarian <laughs> base Leonardo sandwich. Leonardo the Veggie. That's yeah. a good oh. rally. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We've got um, our chicken salad. is probably the best you've ever had in Connecticut. It's got cranberries. It's got... Um, that extra kick. Is that this one right here? Oh. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, the chicken salad. that one, girl. Now, listen, on Wednesdays, you have Recession Buster Day, right? Yeah, yeah. We wanted to do something to Let's reflect the economy. Let's get here at the same time. Let's look at this salad. Mm. We wanted to do something to reflect the economy. So on Wednesdays, you get five ninety nine dozen. Oh. Only at Brugger's in Orange, Connecticut. We're the only Brugger's in the state doing it right now. Um, every Wednesday. Can you call ahead and you can actually have all this stuff prepared? Yeah, 203 uh, 795 1300. Okay. Oh, giving out a number just like that. We ask and Digits. we receive. Okay, love it. What are you making yes. a salad today? What are you so making? By the way, this is unbelievable, but go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Today's a sesame chicken salad. It's just regular mescal mix. Mm -hmm. Got some Ooh. chicken strips. Mm. Now, what is this? That's uh, chow mein noodles. Okay. A little sesame. Pinch of sesame. Okay. Just a pinch, he says. Just a pinch. Okay. A couple almonds. There's your health for you. I love it. <laughs> yes. And some dressing. That's not bad. And then it's just a toss. I'm going to take a bite of this too and see how this is. I don't and know. what kind of make a believe out of me? That's a Pan Asian dressing. Pan -Asian. Oh, say that five times, Sonia Bag Daddy. What is the Pan Asian dressing? It's just got to make sure. Look at him. He's just like, listen, yeah. <laughs> it's a it's secret. <laughs> yes. That's what that means. We can't give it away. I, I can't recipe. give it out. Okay. You know what? You know what we want to do? We've got this salad. I'm going to get a plate out. We're going to bring Joe in to give us a real taste okay. test here. Okay. Let's just see if you can woo the big guy. All Joe, right. Joe get on in here. Yes. Come on, Joe Piscopo. Oh, He's saying, you, you're talking to me? Yeah, we're talking to you, Joe. Come on in here. Let's see. Oh. When's the last time you had someone like Joe? I mean, this big guy. Joe's like a big chef. I mean, I'm telling you right now. Come on in here, Joe. Joe, I recommend the chicken salad. Good. Okay. I just get nervous. That's what I see a man with rubber gloves on. Uh -huh. That's the only thing. It's just a little fact that he knew immediately. Good to see you. How you doing? Nice hey, what's up, Joe? How's it going? Me too, my friend. Nice to see you. Try this and then try that. This Let me get you a fork. I haven't had breakfast yet. Mm. This, this is, is breakfast. So this, this is good. And would you do all this with a bagel? You know what? I must say, I always eat when I'm on the road. I always eat very, very clean. I always get everything grilled. And when I have to, when I talk to room service, so you yeah. talk to the hotels, you got to tell them, you know, you know, no butter. I don't, I don't have butter or anything like really? that. Really? Yeah, I don't have red meat when I'm on the road either. Do you eat no do you stick with the red meat? Yeah. If it's yeah. lean enough, yeah. though, because sometimes when they do the red meat, they want to marble it so there's too much fat in it. Oh, say but, it as it what so. What gives me energy really is grilled chicken breast, fish, rice. Mm -hmm. How boring am I? I mean, okay. You know what I mean? No. As a matter of fact, I talked to Sylvester Stallone. He's the guy that told me oh. about it. Remember how jacked up Sly was? And I said, how do you stay like that? He goes. 
fish and rice. <laughs> fish and rice. Yeah, that's it. I want you to take a bite. Give us a, give us a taste over here. With oh, that. Oh, Tell okay. us what you think. Okay. Uh, so we... <laughs> what am I going to do? I'm on television. I, I know. Hey, take no, a bite. In the take meantime. Take it. Say it's awful. In yes. the meantime, we'll put Burger's information up I'm setting up Monica with this big guy with the muscles. Is that your brother there? That's my little brother. I got Monica a date because I'm a respectable guy. She goes, Joe, can I come to your show? So I start to hit on her because I'm like single. What is going on? Here. If you doesn't... want to try this stuff, if you want to hit up Burgers think... Bagels, of course, on Boston Post Road, it's well, 263. That, that Thank yeah, you so much. Yeah. Dave Katz, you're always awesome. Hey, Look nice at us. You get Joe going. You get us yeah. all going. Yeah. We'll, we'll be right back. Stay with us.